Hey, what's up guys? It's Aaron from Coney Island Saucery. I just started a video before. I didn't realize that you couldn't see half the stuff I was doing. So I'm doing it again. I have to do the other side of the ribs. I'm using to baste the ribs a Trailer Park Boys decent hot sauce. All right, so what I do is you take this sweet baby here. There's a new one. Oh, it's freshly cracked. Hmm, smells freshly cracked. I'm gonna take this squeeze bottle. I have still a little bit in there, but I think I need a little bit more from the last last video. There we go. There's we go. Alright, now it's all full. Full of decentness. There's a whole lot of decentness going on right there, let me tell you. Alright. This time, I got these guys because I used my hands last time. Let me tell you, it's freaking hot. All right. So, let me sit there and switch this so you can see what I'm seeing this time. All right. Got my smoker. Got some ribs. Let's take a look at this sucker here. So, a lot of people, what they do is they use barbecue sauce and water it down with some... Uh, some vinegar. Look at those guys. Yeah. This time, you can see what I'm doing, and I got these. So I'm not burning my freaking hands off. All right. So actually, what I gotta do is I gotta flip them because I have some sauce on one side. Let's see if I could do this while I'm holding the camera here. There we are. I'm gonna take this and make these guys it's a little bit more decent with our trailer park boys decent hot sauce all right here's we go yeah get up on there so I want to hit it and I'll put it back in for a little bit so this way it will evaporate come a little bit thicker The, there's my water pan right there. Let's see if I don't want to do too much. There we go. And this is going to be before the wrap. So we're pretty close here. I'm going to flip them. I'm going to decent them. Let them hang out for another 10 minutes and I'm going to wrap them. And then I'll put it in for another three hours. So it becomes even more decent. Notice how I use the word decent a lot. And that's just straight, straight hot sauce right there. It's not a really hot hot sauce, so it's not gonna like kill anybody. <laughs> it's just gonna bring a whole lot of flavor. It's got the garlic. It's got the vegetable oil blend. It's vegan and it's delicious. All right guys, I'm gonna close this up here. Ugh. One hand in it. All right. Oh, just so you know, we got a bunch of these in New York City, and these uh, are amazing for keeping wood, smoking wood, and whatnot. And I use this one here for all my charcoal and some extra paper when I got to start a fire. So that's what's up. It's a whole lot of, whole lot of goodness there. I have to run out after after a while. And uh, yeah, I'll be on later. This is our bad boy, and I'll show you how it went, how it turned out. All right, later. Hey, what's up? It's Aaron again, Coney Island Saucery. I'm back. I'm about to uh, wrap up these ribs. I just put on some of the Trailer Park Boys decent hot sauce onto it it made it very <laughs> decent so starting to rain of course every time I barbecue it seems to rain it's like I feel in my bones time to barbecue you know type of thing so I got my uh, well, let me switch this so I can make sure I see what you see all right so I got my tray got the sauce
God damn. That's always beautiful. All right, I'm gonna, now I'm gonna move this over here. Move this over here. I'm gonna keep this over here because I need that. Grab my, my tray. So I'll get some ribs out of here and get them ready for the wrap. Look at that. Look at that right there. Oh, yeah. You're a bad girl, aren't you? You're a bad girl. <laughs> there we go. Think about it, man. We're only halfway through this guy. Let's see if I can get this thing out. There we go. Another three hours is going to go in. We have to wrap it. At this point, it's not going to take any more smoke. Now it just needs to slowly cook and beast and just deliciousness. Oh, yeah. Let me smear that all over. Oh, that's all I'm saying. Blam! That's right, sucker. Get on there. All right. Let me close this up. And is anybody here that I happen to know? Anybody got any questions? They just want to sit there and just look at me. I know you do. Okay, no, 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 no. I'm kidding. All right, let's uh, grab this stuff here. Let's bring it inside. Right here. I'll put that there. I'll put it right on top. They could be friends. Oh, boy, that's heavy. Okay. Let me see if I can get over this wire. Ooh, I nearly lost you. There we go. All right, let me set this up here. Let me turn this around. Okay, so now I gotta do the wrap. Not a hip hop wrap, because I can't wrap the wrap for my life. I'll try my best. All right. So, let's see here. Let me switch this. Let me get a good uh, angle. Of the wrapping situations. There's it is. All right. So now I gotta take a whole crap load of tin foil. This is how I keep my tin foil, by the way. I like it on these things. It's freaking nearly empty. I gotta go out and buy another one. I usually have a big thing like this. That's like Costco style. This is my little my little situation. My little station. I can keep things nice and tasty. Alright. Do I have that there? Alright, cool. That I think that works. Alright. I'm gonna move this over here. Okay. Right. So now I'm gonna do I'm gonna take some of this uh and yeah, look at that. Yeah, they're, they're, they are pretty greasy right now, huh? Yeah. Mmm. I'm going to take some of the sauce here, and I'm going to... Here, I'll just show you. I'm going to take some of the sauce and just kind of hit it. Just so as it wraps, it will be marinating. forget about the, the decent hot sauce squeezins. It's where the magic happens. Okay. 
I see like Randy coming over my house right now saying, forget about the burgers. A little bit more. Okay, number three, number three. Get that squirt. Yeah, that's it. That's about right. Okay, let me see how that. Yep. Okay, so this is three hours smoked with some basting with the Trailer Park Boys Decent Hot Sauce from Coney Island Saucery. If you want to give it a shot yourself, you can go to ConeyIslandSaucery.com and there you can find where you can get your own bomb. All right, now, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to put this right on tray and you guys can go take a walk with me. How's that sound? Yay, so much fun. We're walking. All right, let's get here. Let's get over here. Yeah, I wish this was all ready for uh, summer. Obviously, I would have everything out. The lights be up. My tree needs a little bit of a trimming. But we're not quite there yet, are we? Okay. So I'll put this down here. I'm grabbing, grabbing you guys. Open the smoker back up. Yeah, it's still nice and smoky. That's all the, the water pan, all the juices, all that stuff. So people like say it's a really good idea to collect that and like add a little bit to mashed potatoes. I don't know. That sounds like a pretty good idea to me. All right. So this I don't have to really get too crazy about. It's gonna toss it in my hand. Oh come on, dude. There we go. That's nice. That's a good boy. Get in there, buddy. Okay. Time to close her up. Okay. So that is the wrap. I will be back with a hunger of vengeance in three hours. So you guys can sit there and see the finished product. All right, till then, later guys. Oh, mm. that's decent. Hey, what's up guys, it's Aaron. Um, I'm back, I tried to do some fancy schmancy shot. I think it worked a second ago, but it's not working now. So I took off the ribs, um, they're resting right now, but I'm gonna cook a few other things. Uh, as you know, we used our yeah, our Trailer Park Boys decent hot sauce. We made those ribs extra decent. I'm sure they're gonna be delicious. When I pulled them off, they were super, super soft. But right now, I'm gonna go hood. I'm gonna make some instant mashed potatoes, but I'm gonna freaking unleash some fury on that. So, hold on. So, got my hot water. Got my tater powder. I'm gonna make tater powder here. Mix it up. Let's get some more tater powder. That's right. Usually I like to make everything from scratch, but I am being super lazy today. So let's get this sucker a little integrated super fast. But 
what I like to do is I'm going to take a little bit of Locatelli cheese. All right. So this will bring the, the salt up a little bit, but also give it a nice uh, kick. It's like it's a Parmesan cheese, except it's made with goat's milk instead of cow's. So it's a little sharper, which I'm kind of into. Then I'm going to take some garlic. Got my garlic press here. Fancy schmancy, huh? Oop, sorry. <laughs> Wrong way, man. All right, and then I'm gonna use a little bit of adobo. It's funny, adobo has turmeric in it, which uh, is a yellow color, but it's a lot of flavor to adobo. It's like the miracle spice. I don't know, you could take something bland, and throw some adobo in there, and you're golden. All right, look at that. Done. All right, now we're gonna work on a salad real quick. Right now I'm doing all this stuff to let the, let the ribs rest. So if you pull it off too soon, then it's gonna turn into a crazy mess. So I'll pop this over here. Ooh, that wasn't, I'll get that later. My first time doing this, so uh, don't mind me if I'm a little uh, all over the place. All right, let's get my knife honed. All right, let's get these guys going. Tasty tomato action. Every time I cook, I like to have a salad because uh, balances everything out. I also like to have a starch and I like to have a meat. So this will be done in a second. Hope everybody's being safe right now over in uh, Coronaville. Uh, it's pretty brutal out there, so stay home, don't be crazy. Heard a bunch of people went out today to see the hospital boat in New York, which, uh, I don't know, man. They tell you to stay home, you don't stay home. Don't complain if you get sick. All right, let me get some onion. going on so far. I got some arugula. It's pre-washed. Saves even more time. Slap this guy in there. Don't worry, my hands are super clean for more than one reason. All right. So here I got a leftover avocado. It's from yesterday. It already turned a little dark, but it is from yesterday, so it's not ancient. Don't worry. It's it's totally fine. Figured throw it in there. What the hell not? Nah. See? There you go. It's green. So you know what? No. I'm tossing it. Never mind. Thought it was good. Guess it went quicker than I thought. So sorry. Anyway, um, so what I gotta do now is I'm gonna take some Italian seasoning. Salt. Ooh, sorry. Pepper. Some olive oil. And some rice wine vinegar. This is my favorite vinegar to use in salads. Sometimes I like balsamic, but it's sometimes you just don't want sweetness. Then, more crushed garlic. If you notice, our hot sauce is super garlicky. <laughs> We're gonna absolutely love garlic, and it's really good for you too. Alright, awesome. I'm gonna get my spoons.
You can add a little sugar in here if you want. I used to, I kind of stopped trying not to eat so much sugar nowadays. In fact, our hot sauce has zero added sugar, none. So if you guys are on that keto diet or just you have uh, diabetes or any kind of sugar issues, our sauce will be totally fine for you. It's not a sweet sauce. It's definitely on uh, vinegar forward, a lot of garlic. Round it off with the vegetable oil blend. Add a little bit more. Done. All right. Now to unleash the rib fury. After six hours or so of smoking, we're gonna see where we're at. Well, let's get a. Just wipe this down a little bit. Great. I'm just throwing this on here so I don't get it all over the place. Here's one of the ribs. Look, look how loose that is. Look at that. Man, this sucker's gonna fall apart. Actually, I took it off a little bit earlier than I said because I thought it was gonna fall apart too much. It might be that the case this time. Look at that. It's already. <laughs> so I basically I put all I did was uh, I put on uh, some mustard, put on a rub, smoked it 270, did a couple of hits of this uh, hot sauce here to keep it nice, moist, and juicy. Wrapped it up after three hours, put it back in. It's been like less than three. I said it's going to be three, but obviously I don't need it to be that much. So. All right, let's uh, flip this guy over here. Let's take a look here. Oh my God, it's just falling apart. I'm being careful because I don't want my knife hitting the metal too much because it's going to destroy it. So I'm just kind of just pressing down while I'm moving a little. Yeah, I put that there. That's the magic, my friends. That's the magic. You go to uh, ConeyIslandSaucery.com if you want to try it yourself. Make your food decent too. Look at that. Woo, boy. Yeah, look at this, man. Do you want to? Do you want to stay in? Take a look. <laughs> look at the, look at that. Look at this. <laughs> look at that. I think it could have stayed. I think it could have uh, been taken out a little bit less. Next time, I'll take a note and do that. Let's give it a shot. Mmm. Damn, man. Now all you gotta do is, um, all you gotta do, man, is, is just add your own favorite barbecue sauce or make your own get crazy. Yeah, look at that. Just butter. Total meat porn butter, my friends. Feel a little dirty right now, you know what I'm saying? I feel like um, I should be in secret, but I'm not. I'm showing the world. Okay, so now I'm gonna do a plate, put it all together. Just wash my hands, all right? What's this doing here? Get out of here, man. All right, I got my fancy schmancy plate. Keep it a fancy yet shamancy. Let me get a spoon for my got the locatelli mashed potatoes. Put some here. A little bit more. 
So I worked hard cooking, so I'm hungry. All right. Let's get some of this salad going here. I drop a little piece, but no worries, I'll fix that. Let's get a couple of tomatoes on the top, make it look a little purdy, huh? All right, all right, where's my tomato? Wrong spoon. There we go, I think that makes it pop a little bit more. Take our ribs. Angle a little bit so you can see the inside. And it's funny because we use a lot of hot sauce, but it's not really, I didn't taste any heat at all. So if you want, you can add a little bit more at the end. You know, let's make it a little bit more decent, shall we? Let's get some heat on that sucker. What's that? Trailer Park Boys, these are hot sauce. Let's go. A little, 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 little something. There we go. Just a little. That's what I'm talking about. And if you want to get crazy, just do the professional wipey wipe. Wipey wipe. Wipey wipe. Oh, wipey wipe. That's 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 what uh that's professional right there. The wipey wipe. Wipey wipe. Okay. There we go. Let me try it. Make sure everything else came out good. How fast was that? How fast did I put that together? Except for this, man. Obviously, it took me hours and hours to put together, but it is what it is. Yeah, man. Cheesy, garlicky. The potato already has kind of a butter thing going on there, so it's it's super rich. That's perfect. Let me try the salad. Arugula is a little spicy on its own. That's why I'm a big fan of arugula. A rice wine vinegar, man. That's what's up. You don't know about it. Now you know. And we got the ribs, which obviously I tasted before, but let's take a look at the full apart. Let's, oh, look at that. Look at that, guys. With the decent sauce. Let's see that. Oh, yeah. That's killer. For sure. Alright guys, like I said, you guys want to try some of this sauce, go to ConeyIslandSaucery.com and uh, you can get yourself a bottle. Uh, feel free to hit me up if you have any questions. Um, I'm going to go get fat and happy. Guys, stay safe out there. Enjoy.